There have been so many layoffs in 2025 and the major reason behind that companies are quoting is AI or employees not being able to learn AI. That's something that's the most important reason and how these enterprises are using AI. Let me give you a very simple example. One of the biggest banks here in our country is using AI agents to help process claims for vehicle insurance. For example, the process earlier used to take some X number of days. Now it is taking a few minutes to get it processed. For example, the customer whose vehicle has been damaged, he clicks the photograph from different angles of that vehicle and then it is uploaded and that is processed using AI agents. It analyzes those images and processes the claim within a few minutes. So a lot of these enterprises are looking at AI agents as solution to different problems, reducing the time spent to do a specific task, reducing efficiency of workers and a lot more. And this video is going to be all about building those AI agents that can help those enterprises. And I am here using a specific platform known as Area that not only helps helps you build those AI agents but orchestrate those AI agents that companies have been using in different spaces like finance, healthcare and many more. I'm going to work upon a book summarizer agent or a music recommendation agent and we'll see the platform how can you use that and how can you build your agents that can be customized as per your requirement. If you are new to this channel make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to this channel for more such amazing videos coming ahead and now without any further ado let's get started. So now I'm here on the screen and I'm going to help you build a specific agent and I'll also be showing you some important use cases that I saw in their community tab and you can also see. Later we'll see the entire walkthrough of what are some of the important aspects of this platform that can help build enterprise AI agents that are very very useful and solves a lot of problems in different industries be it finance, be it healthcare, be it customer management and a lot more. So this is the project that we're going to see and uh, you can uh, like once you click on once you sign up or once you start a free trial at area platform then you will be having a, a platform like this wherein you can uh, click on get started and you can go to the project section we'll go to the project section and click on default project once you click on default project there are different things that you can see agents models data sources prompts user prompts memories knowledge graphs and so on here you, you have uh, this on the screen add a new agent for example if you click on add a new agent I'll just see I'll just show you what the interface looks like and how can you uh, get things up so for example this is something that's there in front of you you have a specific input that you can give an input from anywhere it can be a text input it can be an image input or it can be a video input also then a specific AI model that you can put in for any use case currently it is it has GPT 4.1 but I'll show you in models you can choose every model you have uh, like models available from all the holders be it OpenAI or Gemini or uh, Anthropic for for even smaller use cases also and for larger use cases also and this is the output that you can get so this is the interface it's easily it's very flexible and you can just modify get stuff done add certain things here and there and this is how it looks like for example if you want to add a data source in this particular uh, agent right for example i want to put in something like this right so this is the data data source and if i want to attach this here or if i want to attach this here i can do that it should go to the data source and it should go to the output for example if i want to add anything but it can be any tools it can be any any uh, memory it can be agents it can be code blocks for example python code if i want to attach a python code here you can write your code here and you can simply attach it to your ai agent for example i want the ai agent to go to this python code and then it should come up with some other input so this is this is the flexibility and the ui that you can see for building any and every agent and now let's see some of the agents that i've already built i think it would be very very helpful for you to understand what kind of agents are already available on the platform they have also recently launched area community where you can contribute as well as you can use the predefined template for example uh, you can submit your own agents as you can see you uh, you can build an agent at the area platform you can select contribute where you can choose to choose an option to contribute to the community and review and Confirm information will be shared and you can send your submission to area for review after it is reviewed it would be live on their platform and anyone across the world can use that for building their agents see how powerful this platform is and this community gives you a chance to contribute to the entire world as well as you can also kickstart your agent building journey from the already available templates from the community right so this is how it works maybe you can read more about it I'll give the links in the description I'll just show you some of uh, these for example this is the agent that is 
is a book summary coach agent right uh, you for example we we te- don't tend to read the entire book but we want the summary of the book in in the most concise manner so this is the agent that simply does that so the purpose of this is to quickly read and distill the core ideas key insights summarize easy to understand summaries and we uh, get that in, in in the output so this is the mo- ai model that we have we are using gpt 4.1 this is the prompt that we are given so the prompt is you are a book summary coach and advanced ai agent designed to quickly read and distill the core ideas key insights and actionable takeaways from any book requested by the user provide concise easy to understand summaries and this this is the entire prompt that you can see you can use 4.1 you can use any other model as of now right so this is this is the this is where you can see the output i'll just put it to test you can put it to test from here also this is the interface you can ask or you can see you can ask uh, to review any 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 book from here or if you want to go to the chat platform you can uh, do it from there also so i'll go to chat.area.ai this is a platform where you can see all your agents that you have built for example i built this book summary coach and this is how this looks like this is the another ui maybe you can uh, try this ui or you can try this ui you can ask the uh, summary here for example i want a detailed in depth summary for a diary of a young girl right this is the book that we used to study long back i want an in depth summary so this is how i've given it the prompt i'll just try giving the same prompt to the chat interface as well uh, this is the chat interface let's see how uh, this looks like so this is the interface that you can see in front of you it's it's still working executing the agent flow here So you can see here we we've got the answer. Uh, what exactly uh, is the book that we're talking about? You can also specify if if there's some specific requirements when it comes to uh, the summary, but it is uh, giving you the complete entire summary, right? So it's it's getting done. For example, the overview Die of a Young Girl is a real life story of Annie Frank, a Jewish teenager hiding from Nazis in Amsterdam during World War Two. Structure, it's setting, how it's the format, time frame, key characters. timelines major themes and insights and his development uh diary's legacy actionable takeaways and conclusion so this is this is the summary that it has given us right so this is the agent and you can add you can uh, attach it to any data source that's there in your company or your organization and it would be very very useful and seamless similarly you can see the entire uh, flow here also in the chat interface as well not just this but if you go to the community you can find a lot of these agents you can see popular templates in sustainability in legal finance technology and a lot more there are more than 1000 agents that are already available and you can simply import these agents to your workflow and you can start using them for example if you want to uh, have some agents in e-commerce for example retail pricing designer or a product review navigator or a store performance analysis or product review classifier you can get it here if you are somebody from human resources what kind of agents uh, would be suitable for you so hiring trends scout and uh, agent hiring trends review agent what are the uh, like exit interview summarizers uh, right uh, market marketing so some ai agents for marketing what is what are the crm lead enrichment assistant so you can simply click on this once you click on this you can use this agent directly and it will be open in the interface and you can customize it also or you can use it directly so there are so many other agents available in the community i've tried some others as well so this is a hiring trend scout agent wherein we have given some prompt like you are a hiring trend scout and ai expert specialized in analyzing up to the minute labor market data to uncover emerging hiring hiring patterns for example if you want to know about some specific industries hiring patterns how is tech industry doing when it comes to specific roles in generative ai right so you can get that at that from this specific agent and you can uh, there's another agent that I was testing that is music recommendation monitor for example if you want to 
look out for some recommendations for music for let's say if you want to hear it on a day when you want to relax so it can help you with those recommendations whether it's an english song or whether it's some song in your local language so this is something that you can do so this is how the entire platform looks like but other things that you can see on the platform the most important thing here is you can see different models that are available right when i, when I say models so you can pick any model that can be deployed to your ai agent uh, it, from all the service providers be it alibaba bedrock google mistral or smaller smaller uh, vendors like perplexity or uh, you can you can customize and you can choose any and every model out there based upon your specific use case the second thing that's most important is data sources you can see the data sources here uh, you can connect your agents to uh, your data coming from amazon s3 bucket or azure blob storage or box or confluence whatever right it's service now or uh, notion so this is how you can connect to so many different uh, data sources that are available and you can you can get things done very very easily there's so many tools that you can connect your ai agents to there's so many tools uh if you if you'll see some tools for example if you want to create an asana ticket for example if you want to have a jira uh jql query if you want to create a google doc or if you want to have an outlook create contact or a news api so many say this is something around salesforce there's something around weather stack something around uh, youtube it's there's so many tools available or if you want to add your own new tool that can also be done if you click on add new tool so it will give you a prompt and you can pick and choose what kind of tool you are looking at uh, adding here right so this is another one then there, then there's so many pre-built prompts also and you can create your own custom custom prompts also for example if you want an agent that is just your 24 into 7 travel assistant or that's something that can automate creating assistant or clinical data analyze there's so many different agents that are out there you can put a custom prompt also and uh, uh, you can create your own prompt also so this is how the platform looks like it is very very useful if you are an enterprise company and you're looking out for having a platform where you can orchestrate your ai agents for a specific use case in any industry i think area would be very very suitable for you let me know in the comments below and try building some of these agents yourself to get a complete understanding of what this is going to offer you so that was it for this particular video i hope you understood this enterprise ai agents platform known as area and they have recently raised a funding round and you can start exploring and building agents on area this is something that an enterprise company or an organization can use and has a lot of potential going forward let me know in the comments below if you have any doubts or if you want to ask any questions i'll be more than happy to answer those that was it for this particular video thank you so much all the best good luck and bye